Hello, this is Cindy and welcome to my channel. And today I am showing you my book of spells. This is a book that will be for sale. It has a ribbon closure that goes all the way through the inside of the book. Um, we'll, sh we'll take a look at that later. It has a hard cover and is, this is a um, decoupaged tissue paper cover that is on here. It says, Book of Spells and Incantations, a complete grimoire for witches and warlocks. And no, before you ask, the spells are not included. This is a place for you to keep your own spells or memories. As we open it up, there are three signatures in here. This is a big book. Sky Above, Earth Below, and Fire Within. The first signature is dedicated to the sky. And so there are small journal cards here tucked in. There is a hidden paper clip there that has a few, these are glow in the dark stickers. Place to write. A nice collage with another place to write. And this is a magnetic like a, it's a magnetic bookmark. So if you, when you put it on, it clips to itself. And I really like the design. Two journaling cards here. You have a couple of journaling cards over here as well. A lot, a lot of journaling cards in here and places to hide thing, hide things. Keep your eyes to the moon and get lost under the spell of the moon. There is a tuck space in here, and then there is the moon. What a perfect day for this, because yesterday was the eclipse. Well, when I'm filming this, Monday was the eclipse. I hope you got a chance to see it. Here in the Northeast, it was cloudy, but oh my glory, we still saw the light change, and it was amazing. I loved every minute of it. There's just a little journaling space in here, tucked into the paper clip, and another one over here. And then this is just a hidden journaling space. Looks like an envelope, but is actually a little space to write. And then another hidden space to write in here with another envelope over here. It does the same thing. And this one has a little star paper clip. And that's the sky next to the earth, the earth below. Has a journaling card here and a space here that opens up. There are two journaling cards tucked up underneath here in this particular pocket. Lots of spaces. Oh, that one's coming loose. I'll fix that. Before you buy it, it will be fixed. There's another journaling spot here, another one here, and another one here. And then, of course, four spots here. Seek joy, bloom, bloom, and seek joy. I had fun making these cards. This is the center with another of the bookmarks. This one is a green bookmark to go with the green, uh, the earth. This is all about the earth. It's not nice to fool mother nature. Those of you who are old enough will know that reference. Another journaling card here in the paper clip. And then I just really liked this particular set. This is from a, uh, this is an old Grandma Grossman's sticker set. And I just really liked how it looked. So I put it in here. You have seeds, you have more places to write. Now this is cool. This is a reverse waterfall. So it comes down this way for you to write on. And then it's a pocket as well. And a belly band over here with three 
it's a very tight Nelly band. So there's three pieces in there. A collage on, on here, and then an envelope with a Wild at Heart piece in there. We'll take that one off because obviously that was extra and didn't need to be there. And it flips open this way. And that finishes the earth. And then the largest of the signatures, this is fire. So we have a couple of journal cards here. This is actually under the paper clip. And then this opens up and it's a little folder that you can write in. Lots of spaces to write. And then an envelope with another large journaling card in it and stamps on the journaling card. I had fun with this one. So that goes together all up in there with a collage and the stamps that match here. A couple more journaling cards. Find the fire within. This is a a uh, pocket that has lots of different places and lots of different pieces stuck into it and another journaling spot. I This one was probably my favorite page to make. Oh, for a muse of fire. For those of you who know your Shakespeare. And all of these are separate little journal cards. There's a spot to journal on the back. And of course... Lots of other places. More journaling cards. This is a very decorated journal. Heat. And of course, absolutely no journal about fire would be a complete without the Fahrenheit 451 reference. Belly band with some journaling cards in there. This is another small belly band with another spot in here and another one of the folding pieces. This one folds out and out. I'm probably off screen. It's a double fold. Places to write, lots and lots of journal cards, and another of the bookmarks. This one is orange, appropriately enough. And that's the end. So this is the spell book. It is for sale on my coffee shop. It is a large book. It is 88 pages total. Um, as far as its measures, measurements go, it is eight and a half tall by six wide. It might be a little under six. And it has, of course, the brass ends, the brass corners. Like I said, it's a big one and it is tall. This one is three inches tall. So this is a, a big book. All right. If you're enjoying these videos, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the like button to let YouTube know that you're liking it. In the meantime, stay safe. And this is Cindy signing off.